The Montana University System Board of Regents ramped up their September meeting this week in Butte with a ceremony honoring a major Montana Tech philanthropist. Our Josh Mogolas reports. A day of celebration here on Thursday at Montana Tech as they renamed the School of Mines and Engineering after the family that gave them $31 million. After receiving official approval from the Regents on Thursday, one of Montana Tech's premier colleges now bears the Lance name. After Ryan, the CEO and chair of ConocoPhillips and a 1984 Tech graduate, and his wife Lisa announced the largest donation in university history back in April. I owe a lot to this school for jump-starting my career and getting me on, on the way, learning the business, uh, traveling all over the world. Ryan obviously is a significant leader in the energy field and is respected throughout, you know, worldwide. And so to have his name on our college and their support, it takes Montana Tech to a whole different level. The gift will be split into three different efforts. A large percentage of the funds will go to a perpetual scholarship program for around 50 Montana residents who will receive $4,000 a year for up to four years. One million dollars will go to Ordegger Athletics to help provide scholarships, and the remaining funds will be for a new position at the university, known as the Endowed Lance Energy Chair, who will provide expertise in STEM and help shape the future energy workforce. As we try to build that expertise that can inform policymakers, it can inform uh, research and development in things that can, can turn and help the world transition to a lower carbon forms of energy over time. The scholarship program will begin with next year's incoming fall class of 2024, while the energy chair position is ready to open up to applicants. And Lance says this gift isn't the end of his involvement with Montana Tech. He wants to continue collaborating to ensure the school can keep offering innovational education for generations to come. The intention is this this lives for a long time. Every day is a great day to be an ore digger and today has a big, big exclamation point on that. In Butte, Josh Margolis, NBC Montana.